Normal and inclined surface intersections with cylinders require us to, at times, number the points that are on the cylindrical surface, transfer those to the views so that we can determine where they are as a contour element. The same idea is transferred over to an internal shape. We again find the points on the surface. The height of that cut is determined. Then we're able to project between the two views and determine where each point is. A cylindrical surface that's cut with a normal surface and if the cylinder has two shoulders creates this T shape. Throughout this introduction to cylindrical surfaces you'll see many examples. It's one of the best ways to begin to interpret and memorize what shapes might look like when we have a cylindrical surface that has a cut on it.